about some things, okay? But first of all, if you guys haven't done so already, go ahead and like this video because you guys are gonna like it, okay? I'm gonna give you guys the reasons why I regret my breast augmentation, aka boob job, okay? So a little backstory, I got my boobs done in 2014 as a present to myself, okay? A present to myself for graduating college, okay? So I got them done, amazing, right? Got married a week after, and then two weeks after, I conceived and I got pregnant, you know? Yes, okay, yes! <laughs> So my boobs never got to heal, and I knew I wanted children, and we decided to stop taking birth control. I know you guys are gonna be like, girl, well why would you do that after a boob job? Like that sounds dumb, right? It does, but let me tell you something. I couldn't get pregnant for like my the beginning of my 20s, so I didn't even think I could get pregnant because I've been on freaking Clomid, all that crap. So I was like, it's gonna take hella long anyways. God said, no girl, no it's not, here you go. So anyways, Got them done, right? They were looking real good until I found out I was pregnant and I started throwing up. I never know what they look like healed. So now, your girl, they're like, hey. So yes, I regret getting my boobs done when I, well I don't wanna say regret because regret's a strong word and everything happens for a reason and my stuff would even probably look way worse than it does now. But the point for this video is to let you guys know, if you guys plan on having kids, you know, in a short time, like if you're not planning on having kids for like 10 years, go get your titties done, okay? Get them done. But I'm just letting you guys know right now, if you want to get that done, but you're planning on having a kid soon or you want kids soon, don't even do it until after you have a baby. Because after you have a baby, you can go ahead and get that stomach tucked if you need it, like me. You can get that, you know, snatch, the snatch done. You can get the boobs up. And that's what I have to do now. I'm actually scheduled for my mommy makeover in August after we get back from vacation, okay? Cause I gotta go get a vacation in really quick. So after I get back from vacation, I'm gonna go ahead and get my tummy tucks, I'm gonna get my boobs lifted, and I'm gonna get them exchanged. So currently right now I have saline implants, and according to my doctor, that's like an old, an old thing, the saline. Nobody does that anymore. Like he doesn't even carry them in his office. So I'm getting silicone, and they're safer now because they're not, they're not liquid silicone. They're like a gel, so they're not like an old, leak everywhere okay but i never had any issues with my boobs like the surgery you know obviously it's gonna be painful or whatever whatever but that's why i regret it so i wanted to put this video on here because i want you guys to know just to hold off just be patient wait until you have your kids or if you have one kid and you think you possibly might want two kids girl wait until you have that second kid just wait just wait just trust me and wait for those of you that have had a boob job before a kid and they stayed up <laughs> kudos to you because mine sure didn't okay they said Whoop! so yes but if you guys have any questions about it or anything go ahead and drop them down below go ahead and make sure like i said you're subscribed because i am filming my surgery journey you guys i'm gonna take you there i'm gonna show you my before and after because let me tell you guys something about me right so i'm the like i think i'm fine without surgery right because I love myself, but I can make improvements. The surgery is not gonna change me. I'm still like, right, I'll go outside naked right now. Right now, I'll go in a thong bikini right now in my front yard, right now. I won't care. Will stuff be flopping? It'll be flopping, but that's fine. So <laughs> I'm not embarrassed to show you guys before and after, okay? I've been losing weight and stuff, but I'm literally, it's a body to me. That's it, it's a body. I don't look at it as like a disgusting thing. I could work at, a, at an old people's house, at a nursery home, and wipe ASS all day and not be disgusted. I just don't get disgusted with that kind of stuff. But anyways, I'll see y'all next video. And once again, thanks for watching, you guys. Turn it up, turn it up,